Hey everyone, and welcome to the latest episode of the Daily Devotional with Pastor Grady. I was going to tell you that Miss Jessica's birthday is coming up on April 4th, and when we were first married, she told me that she'd always wanted a surprise party. So, a few years ago, I planned on throwing her a surprise party. Well, leading up to her birthday, she had no idea that I was inviting her friends and getting things ready for a big surprise party for her. And the day of her birthday came, and we she thought we were just going to go out to dinner and just celebrate the two of us. Well, we pulled up to our house, and when she walked in, all her friends and her sisters and her brother-in-law all just popped out and said, Surprise! And little did she know, that whole time I was working on this party. Well, that reminded me of the book of Haggai, and in chapter 2, when God talks about the glory of the new house, and in chapter 2, verse 6, it says, This is what the Lord says, In a little while I will once more shake the heavens and the earth, the sea and the dry land. I will shake all nations, and the desired of all nations will come, and I will fill the house with glory, says the Lord. The silver is mine and the gold is mine, declares the Lord. The glory of his, this present house will be greater than the glory of the former house says the Lord Almighty, and in this place I will grant peace, declares the Lord. Oh, my, my, my headphones fell out. But Haggai, in this chapter, reminds us that God's activity is not new. It is consistent with what he has done in the past and what he will do in the future. I want to just remind you that God is always at work. Even when it seems like God is silent and not there, God is at work and is always on the move. This is something that we should think about and realize, and it should bring us both comfort and confidence. And so today, my question for you is, when have you looked back on your life and saw God moving, even when maybe at the time you didn't see Him moving or you didn't realize it? So... When was there a time that God appeared to have been silent in your life, but later when you looked back on it, you saw him moving all the way? Parents, this might be a good time for, to share some of your story about how God has worked and moved in your life. Well, that's all I have for you today, and so we will see you tomorrow in the next one. And just to let you know, I miss you and hope to see you very, very soon. All right, have a good day.